don't sleep on this restaurant. going on everyone it's your boy Yassine back at you with Halal Food Vlogs episode 2 let's go uh yeah got a got a little too excited there but no anyways we are back with episode 2 of Halal Food Vlogs and today I am at Papa Marco's Grill and Kebab over here in Waukegan Illinois and before I you know get the food and give it a try and give you guys my thoughts and opinions I just want to give a huge huge shout out to everyone who tuned into my first video you know left a comment and everyone who subscribed to the channel uh, I see y'all I really appreciate it and every subscription means a lot to me and if you are new here this is going to be a channel where I'm basically heading to some Zabiha Halal restaurants in the Chicago area trying them out and you know giving you guys my thoughts and opinions but on that note, I am super hungry and I'm really excited to be trying out Papa Marco's Grill and Kebab. I actually used to live very close to this restaurant when I lived in North Chicago. So I actually ordered from this place a lot. You know, just a fair warning, I might have a bit of bias when I'm trying this stuff out and, you know, giving my thoughts and opinions because there is that nostalgia factor there. I mean, I used to order from here all the time. I think the last time I ate here was man more than like two years ago almost like two and a half years ago i'd say so really excited to be coming back here and checking it out so here we are on the outside um as you can see it's right next to this um supermarket and we got the entrance right here uh pretty nice very low-key okay so i just ordered my food this is the entryway of the restaurant um you basically just come inside here then there's a counter here They've got their menu up here. Um, this is like all the Mediterranean stuff, like the kebabs and the shawarmas, and I believe that is what is halal. Um, they have some other like, you know, Western options, but I'm not sure that those are halal. Um, just for my Z gang out there um, tuning in, that is what the halal situation is at Papa Marco's. All right, after waiting for a few minutes, we got my food, order is ready. So let's head on back and give it a try. Okay, so for starters, we have our classic pita bread. Um, looks like there's about three slices in there. So that's going to be good to just kind of eat with my kebab and then eat with all the other sauces they gave. And then it looks like we have, so we got our sauces here. So that'll be kind of nice to have with the kebab as well. Oh, and I just noticed this. They gave me a free a piece of baklava, I guess. I don't know if this comes with the meal or what, but yo, shout out to Papa Marcos, man. I am never going to say no to um, free dessert, so this is awesome. Okay. okay, so now time for the star of the show, the uh, chicken and beef kebab. Opening this up for the first time, so let's see how it is. All right, so you guys ready? Here we go, grand reveal. Woo! Oh man, I can just like immediately tell you that it smells so good. So we got our beef here. Looks very well seasoned, obviously. Um, a lot of other, you know, vegetables to go along with it. We have our chicken with the beef. So that is gonna be really good I can already tell just from how it smells um, we got some tomatoes onions and bell peppers to and then if we just dig under here see we got our rice so yeah very very solid looking meal all right we've done enough talking let's finally give this a try and see how it is so we've got chicken and beef so first I'm gonna try the chicken out with a little bit of the rice go just so you get a better look of it oh 
Okay, really, really good. As soon as I bit into the chicken, it was very moist, very tender. It's got a nice, you know, Mediterranean mix of spices going about it. And then really solid yellow rice to be eating with it. Yeah, that was really good. All right, so next we're gonna go with a bite of the beef with some yellow rice. So, let's give you guys a look. Here you go. Some beef from Papa Marco's. Let's go, bismillah. Yeah, the beef was good. It's not as tender as the chicken, I'd say, but still overall really solid. It's got like that nice Arab mix of spices as well. So that was really good too. All right, so now we're gonna take some of the sauce we got and um, try it with the meat. So let's try it with the chicken first. Okay, so chicken, um, yellow rice. It looks like we got a little bit of vegetable in there and then with the red sauce. Mmm. Mmm, yum. Okay, that was really good. So, the, the chicken in itself is really good, as is the rice, as I mentioned. However, when you put the red sauce on it, for me, it just really made it pop. It has that nice little spice element to it. You know, when I'm eating food, I don't like it being, like, so spicy that I, like, my mouth is just numb and I can't, like, feel it but that is like a good spice level there it's not like super spicy but it has just enough pop and you know add a little extra flavor to it all right so now we're gonna try the red sauce with the beef all right so here you guys go a little onion snuck in there but um i'm gonna be real with you guys i am too lazy to take it out so i guess we're gonna have some onion as well but that is it i don't know if you guys can see it but all right here we go Yeah, man, I really like the red sauce. Like, I feel like it had the same effect with the beef. It's like you just put it on and it kind of adds that extra dimension of flavor with the little spiciness. And then you got, you know, that nice beefy flavor and the rice going along with it. And man, it was really good. Okay, last but not least, we have our baklava right here. Just focus on that a little better. Um, just your standard looking baklava with some pistachios on top. All right, I'm going in. Man, I haven't had baklava in so long, and this is really good. It was still a little warm when they gave it to me, so that's always a plus. And then just a really good baklava overall, I'd say. Um, a lot of nuts in there. Nice, soft, flaky uh, phyllo dough. And yeah, no, just really, really good overall. So overall, this place is exactly how I remember it. Really, really great tasting kebab, nice flavorful rice. So yeah, I am so excited to just devour the rest of this plate I have here. And that's all I've got for you guys today. So please be sure to like this video, comment down below. Have you ever been to Papa Marco's? What have you ordered? Are there any other items in particular that you enjoy? Do you have a different opinion on the food? Sound off in the comments below and be sure to subscribe to the channel. And don't forget to hit that little notification bell so y'all are on top of things when I'm dropping my new videos. So last weekend, I went on a halal food tour with some of my friends in Detroit, Michigan. Our itinerary was to hit seven different spots in a day and a half. So did we manage to do it? Where do we go eat? How did we enjoy the food? I'll let you guys know the answers to all those questions in the next video. I'll see you guys there. Peace.